Hello, my tubies and my Teletubbies. This is Sheila True Love. And I was, I just got through looking at a TikTok of this woman uh, talking about uh, how people were telling her that she's not attractive and nobody wants an old woman or a fat woman or whatever woman. You know, it doesn't matter what a woman's body looks like. It doesn't matter whether she has her natural hair or, let me take this gum out my mouth. Uh, it doesn't matter whether she has her natural hair because I see so many beautiful women and they cannot pull a good man to save them li their lives. They can only pull these demons, abusers. And the reason why I posted a picture, this is my son, okay? Because my definition of a good man is a man who has the mind and the heart of Jesus Christ. So, so many people would say, well, Jesus Christ is perfect. So, that's not possible. Okay. So let's talk about a man who has the mind and the heart of John, the apostle John, because the apostle John was Jesus Christ's favorite apostle. And the reason he was Jesus Christ's favorite apostle was because he was the apostle of love, the apostle of love. So I'm looking at all these women getting all this plastic surgery and all of this, uh, injections, even dying to try to get the validation from a man. And the only man who I've ever met in my life, in my whole life, who has come close to having the mind and the heart of Jesus Christ is my son. That's the man you see right here. And I'm just so grateful that Yahweh, Jehovah, and Jesus Christ gave me the opportunity to be the one to have raised him. Because everywhere I go, I ride the bus going to work. Everywhere I go, people who have met this man, they're always saying, so how is Lewis today? How is this today? That is such a great man. He's terrific. Everybody has nothing but great things to say. And I'm not trying to blow his horn or whatever. But you know, people are always so eager to criticize and to tear people down. And they hardly ever want to give praise where it's deserved. And this is one man who deserves it because I, he's not perfect. Oh, but God, no, he's not perfect. Trust and believe. He has some issues that he's battling each and every day, but he's battling it. And I'm very proud of this man. And like I said, until I can meet a man who has the mind and the heart of Jesus Christ, I will stay single. Or who has the mind and the heart of John, the apostle John, at least the apostle John. Because these women are pulling nothing but demons.